I hope you've been brushing up on your art skills because this week on The Big Canvas, they're taking us back in time all the way to a high school for this truly inspirational story. Prepare to have your mind opened up by the wonders of acrylic and other water-based paints. Benjamin Drobig, an 18-year-old artist, lays it all on the line and dips deep into his past, bringing up the inside scoop on his artistic journey. I actually got bullied quite a lot as a kid, and uh, that just festered up. I actually got bullied for being artistic. Yes, the bullying definitely uh, was an issue for him. I think the art became a way for him to express himself. I was actually going through a pretty rough time when I painted this. I was really like contracting myself from everybody. I really needed to like sort things out, like emotionally. That room evolved, uh, so that was actually my mother's sitting room. Uh, it was a time that Benjamin spent a fair bit of time in there with my mom when she was, uh, she passed away when he was six years old. And uh, so then it became kind of the, the, the kids playroom, hangout room after she had passed away. He started creating things in there. Um, I do recall one time coming home from work and him running and saying, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to. And I said, what <laughs> didn't you mean to? And there was like black paint <laughs> all over the place. And he had started painting uh, using house paint. This painting is by Benjamin Drobig, and he was showing the social issue of homelessness, and he showed it in a really interesting way. In Benjamin's future, I think he should continue to pursue his passion, which is art, and I think there's different outlets for that. I think uh, at the post-secondary stream, he could try to apply to specific colleges for certain programs. There's also wonderful foundations programs at places like Conestoga, uh, that I think would be a really good portfolio building opportunity for him. I would like to actually paint professionally. I just thought it would be kind of good to get back at the kids who are putting me down for being artistic. Stay tuned, there's more Conestoga Connected headed your way.